Oh, hi everyone. Now I'm going to show a short tutorial about how to get the dash in the in the middle of a phone number. So you have a example like this. You've got all these phone numbers, but it, there's no dashes in them. Now you could format these cells like as a custom format to to display to show the dash. But if you want to actually get the, the dashes in the middle, I mean, sure one way is to go in here and physically put the dash in everywhere. But there's an easier way to do that with a couple Excel functions. We're going to use a concatenate, which is going to combine a bunch of, of pieces of this phone number. And then we're also going to use three different functions, the left function, the mid function, and the right function, to kind of break this up. And we're going to put this all into one formula. So I'm going to do it here, and I'm just going to type it in instead of going through the wizard. So we're going to start off by doing concatenate. And what the, this is going to do is just going to combine all the pieces. And the first piece is we want these left three digits. So we're going to do the left function, left. You pick the number that you want to take the left characters from. And then we want the three left characters. So we want the 800 in there. So that's the first piece of our concatenate. Now we want to put the dash in there. So we're going to put comma, then quote, dash, quote. So now it's going to put a dash in there. And then we're going to do comma, and we're going to do the third part of this. And since it's right in the middle, we can't do left or right. We have to do the mid function. So the mid function is one extra step than the left or right. You still have to pick what number you want to take the mid from. But now you want to... The next part is to put the starting number. And the starting number, we want to start with the fourth digit. So we're going to put four. And then how many characters do we want to pull in? So we want to pull in three characters, because the mid middle three numbers of the phone number we want. So I'm going to put a three. So now we got the first three parts of it. Now we're going to do a comma, quote, dash, quote again, because we want a dash. And the comma, then we want the last part, which is the last four digits. So we're going to do the right function. So we're going to put the right four digits of cell A2. So we're going to put A2, comma, and then we want four. And then we put the end parentheses, and we got to put another parentheses to finish off the concatenate. There. And we've got our new number. 1-800 and so on. And we can copy this down. And we have all our phone numbers, and you can copy this down as far as you want. And it still has this formula in here, so if you want to get, get rid of this, you can do a copy-paste special. So we need to copy. paste special, and then the values. If you put values, it's going to get rid of all the formulas, and it's just going to have the numbers in there. And that's just a quick way to get the dashes in a phone number. I mean, this works for anything else, I mean, besides phone numbers, that has a character in the middle that, that you want to insert. So I hope this uh, was helpful. Thanks.